Hey everyone, I'm back. You know, I always get on my lunch break and I have to sit back here and I was thinking about this and it was a question that came um, about and um, someone asked, um, asked me, um, do a narcissist ever love? Do they ever fall in love? Um, did they ever love me? Did, uh, I can only speak for myself and what I have went through. Um, the only knowledge that I know with the narcissist that I came about and came have have dealt with. Do the narcissist love? Once upon a time. They may have thought they was in love, but I don't think I don't think a narcissist is capable of loving. I think a narcissist, what I, my experience, my narcissist only love what she can get. Do you understand what I'm saying? A narcissist only love what you give to them they will say that they love you and people because I know I felt it I continue to say I kept on telling I kept on telling um, this person that I mentioned her name before I don't even think that's her name per, per se um, they are liars. So I want you to know a narcissist is a compulsive ass liars. They will lie, 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 lie. They don't care. They'll lie on their grandma, their daddy, their mama. They don't care. They'll lie on their daughter, the kids. They'll, they don't care. They will lie to get what they want. Do a narcissist love? No. They are in love of what they can get from from you they do not love anyone a narcissist is just like Satan Satan spawn they come from Satan matter of fact I call her that I told her she is Satan spawn at that time I didn't even know nothing about a narcissist when I called her a narcissist I didn't know but then I saw reading books. I started watching videos. I started studying. And then I figured, oh my God, I actually was with Satan's spawn. Do a narcissist love? No. They love what you can give to them. They don't even care if you go broke. Because that's what they're out to do is make you sick. Kill you break you physical mental emotionally this is what a narcissist want to do they're out here to break you they're out here to take your money take your soul what do that sound like that sound like satan satan did it to adam and eve Because Adam and Eve was such narcissists, not, and they had that Gnostic behave, behavior. That's how Satan can control them as being supplies, or per se, quote unquote. They were his suppliers. They supplied the worship. They, they, they supplied the gratification. That's what Norses want. They want you to worship him. Let me tell you. Let me tell you how 
the person who I was dating, I don't even like seeing dating her, but the person who I was dating, she texted me several times. She was telling me because she wasn't getting the love from a worship. Look at that, that word, worship. From anyone else, so they have to get that. They take that from you. I am like the most happiest person since this person been out of my life. But the reason why I make these videos because I want people to understand because I didn't know. I was so naive because I wasn't raised like this. I wasn't raised around people like this, like these individuals. And I had to understand what what was occurring all i want to do is love this person be with this person and i kept on giving 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 and they would never be satisfied listen a narcissist will never be satisfied that's why they don't love you can give it and they ain't gonna never forgive you let me tell you something if you hit a narcissist and you break their ego, you hurt their ego, they will never forgive you. They're going to keep you around so they can torture you because they're miserable in their goddamn life. You know the old saying, misery love company? They are fucking miserable ass people. Miserable. I'm like, right now, since this person been on my life, I'm the most happiest person of all. Um, and people say that. What's going on? AJ, what's going on? You seem like you're so happy. I'm happy because the bitch is out of my life. But I'm on here to warn people who is naive like me. I was naive. People, I was naive. God, I thought this woman would fall and love me like I loved her. I, I would have gave her my whole life, my whole soul. I even told her that. But she wanted my soul so I can give her everything. What I had, my money, my car, my house. She wanted everything. And I never could, listen y'all, everything that you learn about a narcissist, they tell you and you don't pay attention. Like she told me a long time ago, she said, I know you sell um, 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 products on Amazon and eBay. I watch you. A narcissist will watch you. You know why they watch you? To see do you have money. You have supply to give them. That's why narcissists, that's the main reason why, excuse me y'all, it's hot as hell out here. It's 90 degrees. That's why a narcissist, you'll never get rid of them. She told me that and I've never paid attention. She said, yeah, I'll just leave you alone. She told me that this is, they will tell you what they will do. They lie like hell, but you got to pick, Nick, pick your seat. Listen, you got, you have to listen what they say. You have to. Told me. I was searching. I, I, I know you. I know you do that. Showed it. Told me. That's what she said. She knew. They always gonna keep up. She told me, as I was saying before. She told me, um, yeah, I'm a type of person. I'll just um, disappear about two or three months. And I'll show up a year. I'll show up and, hey, how you doing? Like nothing happened. They don't love no one but themselves. And they barely love themselves. So do a narcissist love? 
They love what they can get from you. If you can supply something to them, they love what they can get from you. Not you. They want that because she used to tell me all the time, oh, get on the phone. How dare you? Ooh, that fake, she got an Oscar, baby. Y'all don't know the, she got a fucking Oscar. And I used to hate when she cried because I can't stand a woman cry. I always want to please. I am a pleaser. I am a, I, and I will get supernova on your ass once I f find out you are a narcissist. Now, now I know what a narcissist is. I'll cut you off like that now. I know the traits. I know, the, I know the behavior now. I'll cut you off like that. I, I have met, after her, I have met a lot of females now that I'm like, oh, I can see the behavior, baby. Go on about your business. Don't pay attention. Because I know I'm a good person. Yeah, but she was on the phone. She was like, <laughs> oh, no. how dare you dare me? I don't love you. How dare you? Twan. Twan, because she used to call me Twan. Twan. How dare you? Tell me. I don't love you. That's so full of shit. But at that time, I didn't know that she was faking. She only did that to make it seem like I'm the vic I, she's the victim and I'm the bad person that's the only reason why she did that so I can apologize and I did I'm sorry I didn't mean to question question your love exactly what I said an empath will do that she oh, she always just call herself an empath my god <sighs> yes and I used to apologize all the time. Arguments used to come all the time. I'm getting stronger every day, people. And I want people out there to listen. If you are going through something with a narcissist, please leave. Please leave. I, this is the only reason why I'm making these videos. Because I didn't know anything about a narcissist. And I hope this video can reach out to people and let them know that... Um, it's people out here that are not survivor. I got two t-shirts right now. Just was delivered. Um, um, that I ordered. And I will be wearing it around. One day y'all going to see me record. And I'm going to have it on. I'm going to have one is North survivor. And the other it gives a definition. How I feel about a North. Um, they are nasty evil asses. Assholes. And I'm telling you guys. You, you really have to get away from them you have to have totally no contact with them because they will hoover you hoover if you don't know what hoover is they will say oh baby i love you i didn't mean to do that i'm gonna go to um a psychiatrist um uh, uh, we're gonna work it out we're gonna this is hoovering this is hoovering and once they get you in their grips again you're going to have, you think that you went through hell before? Baby! You're going to go through more hell than what you went through. Because, you know why? Because you took away their energy. And, and they had to put all their energy on you. To get you back. That they could have been out there getting more supply from other people. So... They're going to get, they're going to put more, they're going to put you through more. If they got, the, the more they put energy on you, and the more hoovering they have to do, they're, they're going to hurt you. I had, I had a convert, a, a convert, um, um, narcissist. That's what I had. That's what I, and, 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 and if you don't know what that is, that's a person who used their looks. Um, looks and all that on you as being a narcissist. People, 
If you are with a narcissist, please, I beg you, walk away. If you see these signs <coughs> that they are only caring about themselves, they never buy you nothing, literally. I have known that person for eight years. She gave me, out of eight years, she gave me $20. Let me tell you about that one <laughs> before I go. She, she, like, she, I, I never receive anything because I always wind up meeting narcissists. I didn't know that. Like I said, I, I, no, I can't, I take that back. Other, the other people I dated wasn't narcissists, but this was the worst of all. And, um, she, she turned around and I'm like, I was in a store. I wanted to eat some catfish nuggets. And she said, so how much your lunch is going to be? And I said, if, it, if I buy it, it's going to be like almost 20 bucks. She cashed at me 20 bucks. I never had, I never, I always was a giver. I'm always a giver. But I, this time, I'm like, if I get in a relationship, I, it's going to be a give and take. I, I can't do this. And um, she gave me that twenty dollars, baby. The following day, I spent fifty. A narcissist is not gonna give you nothing unless they're gonna get something in return. And I said it. I said, "Hell, you should have kept your twenty. I wouldn't lost thirty. They always wanting something. They don't give you nothing without something. And she thought, she, it's the first thing came in her mouth like, see, I have no problem of giving. I have no problem. Eight years. Eight years. Eight years that I have known her. I received one thing. $20 bill. $20 bill. And the following day, I spent 50 So basically, I didn't receive nothing if you want to get that. If you want to go that route. But I appreciate it. And I told her, I said, thank you. I just cried because I never, be, I never received anything from her. And I couldn't believe it. And I told her, I said, thank you. I never, just, I never received anything from you. And I'm, I appreciate it. But her, on the other hand, she received a lot of things from me. It's what you can give to them. They don't love no one. No one. No one. They don't care about no one. They don't love no one. They can give a damn about you. For real, for real. People, are, if you're in a relationship, I advise you, if you're in a relationship with a narcissist, and there's all different types of narcissists. Let me tell you something. I am learning that different types, they can be masters of it, Converts, they can be all different types of narcissists. And let me tell you something. They will fool you, baby. They will fool you. They will fool you like no tomorrow. And they will lie. And they will cheat. They care nothing about no one. Get away from them demons. Get away from them devils. Get away from Satan's spawn. I'm telling you. Man, I was so freaking miserable. God just, he had to just pick me up. That day when we just, when I don't know what happened to this day. It's like his spirit 
The day when I called her a narcissist I, and I cut ties, I blocked her on everything. I don't know, it's his spirit. And I didn't have all this protection on. I wear now, baby. I read faithfully. Oh, my God, I wear faithfully. Burn my candles. Do my thing. Faithfully. Just, I want them away from me. I want her away from me. I, um. That day, and I'll tell you that, and then I'll just leave. Um, that day, we was on the phone. And I always want to explain it when I end. When we was on the phone, we was talking about something. I always thought, I always just forget about things because that's me. I just don't want to remember, but I remember I don't want to talk to her. Um... We was talking on the phone and I think she was trying to start an argument that a narcissist will do that. They will start an argument because they're trying to get to their new supply. And I think she had a new supply. I didn't care. I didn't care. I just wanted out. Because that whole week I wasn't feeling right. I And I left from work and, and I explained this in my previous videos. Uh, I, le I left from work. That week it was something going on with me. And all of a sudden she said, Twine, did I ever tell you that I have, I called you a long time ago when we first met that you're an egotistic? And I'm like, and I ever told you that you're a narcissist, ladies and gentlemen. Gentlemen. I don't know where the freak that comes from to this day. Never called a woman out of her name. Never. Never called her a narcissist. Till this day, I don't know where that come from. But I hit it dead on the dot. Like I was... The only thing I could think of is my super... At this time, like what I know now, my supernova empath was coming out. It was starting... It started to defend me because God was blessing me and saying, listen, enough is enough. Because at that point, I told her, because she told me she would, she would never, um, what's she doing? Because I would always, because she lived in Atlanta and I live in St. Louis. And I was always saying, let's talk on um, FaceTime each other. And she said, you too much in the doghouse. I said, well, can you buy me anything? And she said, you too much in the doghouse. And she kept on saying, I think that's what we was talking about. And I said, you know what? I said, lady, I do me a favor. Keep me in the doghouse. And that's when she said something about egotistic. And I said, and you're a narcissist. And something just lift up over me. Like I told you, for a whole week, something was bothering me it was eating my soul up i was depressed when i say i was depressed i was depressed people i was depressed i was crying i didn't know what was going on i didn't know but now i know it was demons because i was messing with her and i just wouldn't let her go And God was trying to tell me, you got to let her go. She is not for you. She is evil. And when I said that, I said, and you are a narcissist? And I hung up the phone. I never got back on the phone ever and spoke to her ever again. I blocked her on everything. That's when she had other people call me and threaten me. And the narcissist will get their little monkeys and start nitpicking at you. Because they're trying to bring you. You're the one that got away. Get away. When you're getting away from them, they're trying to get you, bring you right back. Trying to grab you back. Bring you back to them. So they get other people who they talk to you about. I remember when I called her and I told her, I said, you ain't never 
never disrespect you, never call, cuss you out, never did anything. But you ain't never seen the side of me. You finna see the side of me. I cussed her out like no tomorrow. And when I was cussing out, she had this guy in the background. And she said, you hear her? She made this guy think that she's the victim and I'm the one, the predator. And they will do that. A narcissist will do that. So do they love you? She kept on telling me that she loved me. No. It's what I can give to her. It's what I can give to her. A narcissist will have sex with men, women, dogs, children. They will have sex. They don't give a damn who they have sex with. And they will tell you a lie. Oh, I'm a lesbian. Oh, I'm gay. That is a complete lie. They have no loyalty. They have. They don't care who they sleep with. As long as they get their supply. A narcissist will also, like I said, you, you guys have to make sure and nitpick what they say. They will tell you the truth, but they lie. Oh, mostly lie. They are compulsive ass liars. But you have to listen. See, I, I'm, I'm going back. Sometimes I go back and I say, she told me this. She, told, she said all that. And I wasn't paying no attention, but I was paying attention. You get what I'm saying? A narcissist will have someone next to them and say they, they're a friend and knowing they fucking them. A narcissist will bring you STDs. They have no loyalty, baby. They don't care about no one but themselves. Really care about themselves. So do they love? No. Absolutely not. Do they show love? No. And if they do, it's something what they want. Beware of Satan's spawn. Them people are evil. I'm telling you. You've got to beware. And these are things that I only can speak of. I'm, I'm speaking of straight and gay. I'm, I'm a lesbian. I, yes, we go through it. I'm a stud. You can see. Here. Went through it with a film. We go through it in the LGBTQ community. And the straight people go through it too. Lord knows they go through it. I see it. I'm in a um I am in a narcissist one on one um group on Facebook. We got narcissists on there. I had a block a person who was a narcissist on um in that group. Why right off back? She was a narcissist and I saw it. It's amazing how once, once Jah, Jehovah, lift your eyesight. Your third eye is open because I put my oil on and I, I just, I just listen to him now. Once he gets you to listen and understand him, you see everything now. Like I tell you, and everyone who have a narcissist in their lives, please leave. They will take you down. I had bags, baby. Listen. I had bags all under my eyes. I no longer have bags. I'm talking about deep bags all under my eyes when I was messing with her. I was so unhappy. When I went home, I was so... And you're more lonely with them than I'm single. I'm not alone. I'm not alone. I'm not lonely. Yeah, I am dating now. I'm happy I'm dating. And it's funny because not only her nurse's ass I have my other ex-girlfriend. She's trying to get back in. I had to tell her today. Please leave me alone. Please. 
people who, I'm going to say it again, I just want to express because I want you to understand you got to get away from this narcissist. You got to get away. Only way, like she, she dated someone for two years. And the only reason how they dated and they stayed with each other for two years because that individual was a narcissist. Yep. Stay away, baby. Get out. No contact. Drop that. Drop that. Drop that person real quick. Run like you ain't never run in your life. You know what I'm saying? Run, farmers, run! Run your ass off. I'm telling you, and it is no joke. Listen, I ran. I clicked that phone up, blocked up on everything. What's up? Oh, don't let me get on the apps. D narcissists love apps. I'm gonna do that next time. I'm gonna talk. I'm gonna talk about apps. Don't let me get started by apps. Narcissists love apps. They are not faithful. They are not faithful. They are not faithful. I do want to show. Oh, let me show you my cool tattoo. Um, it's Africa. Made out of animals. <laughs> I love that. Cool tattoo. Shout out to um, um, T Dags in um, St. Louis. Um, off of Bell Fountain, they did a great job. Man, did a great job. I mean, I gave him a tip the first day, and um, I left, and I came back the following day, and Gay had to give him another tip. I, and they're a reasonable price and did a great job. You people, I just love you guys. I really, really, really love you guys. I, I, I'm, I'm talking to the people who's going through it. These are the things that makes, make you happy. Do something about it. If you want to do something about it, go and do it. Get away from the narcissist. You're not going to be happy while you're with that narcissist. Once I, once I got away, I'm doing a whole lot of things. I mean, a whole lot of things now. Since I got away from that narcissist. And you can do it too. If you get away from the narcissist. Please. Get away from the narcissist. These narcissists don't care about nobody but themselves. Or their next supply. Love you guys. Gotta go back to work. 